Hey guys, it's Classic and welcome to my simple and short guide on how to be more consistent in Rocket League. Consistency is probably the single most important skill to have in Rocket League and today I'm gonna give you two simple rules to achieve consistency that would make your mama proud. Please note that these rules can help you at any ranks be it Wood 5 or Grand Eggplant. The first rule is a broad one, but it will guide your training in all of your Rocket League career. Do not practice something until you get it, but rather, practice it until you can't miss. This has to be the biggest piece of advice I have ever received while trying to improve at Rocket League. If you truly want to reach higher ranks, what matters is not your peak abilities and being able to score a ceiling shot 2 times out of 20, but rather, your personal skill floor and how reliable you can be. When you see the ball coming at you and then identify the required shots, you need to be able to achieve it instinctively without even thinking about it. This is also referred as muscle memory. Every ounce of mental energy you are using on how to make the shot could better be used to think about where to place it, be more aware of your surroundings, trying to see if you have a teammate close, and all that useful awareness. That sounds cool, Classic, but how do I implement that? Fair question, and that brings us to our second rule, which is much more practical. Whenever you do a training pack or workshop, use the consistency rule. The consistency rule means that for every shot you try, you have to succeed three times in a row before moving on. The same applies to every training you do. Here's an example. In this double touch training, I need to make sure it goes in three times before moving on. Succeeding twice in a row and then failing prevents me from going to the next shot. This method of training will be far more efficient to achieve our first rule, practicing until we can't miss. As you can see here, the first two shots went well. I was able to manage three shots in a row fairly easily, but as soon as we get to the third one, we can already see I am not that much comfortable. And even though I scored the third one, it wasn't a double touch, therefore, I had to reset. By doing so, you will get much more comfortable at this single shot in every single angle possible, because you realize soon enough that even if you can achieve it three times in a row, it's likely that every shot will be slightly different and this will widen your options, you'll be better at recovering the shot if you miss the initial touch, it's gonna have multiples great effect on the long term. Armed with these two simple rules, you will be able to improve much faster, but be warned, you will often fail at the third shot and it will reset a counter. Oh no, that was so close. It can get extremely frustrating. You will want to throw your controller on the ground, I can sense it from here. But if it frustrates you, that's good. That means you need to practice more and you know where you have weaknesses. It's the only way to actually improve. It's to be able to narrow down your weaknesses and then slowly but surely fix them. Hopefully, these two rules will help you in all of your Rocket League career. Just try to always remember the simple advice. Practice until you can't miss. Good luck on the pitch. Thank you.